Hi there. In this recording, I'm going to show you how to record something in SoundCloud and then upload the link to that recording in your Moodle class. So, the first thing to do is go to soundcloud.com. You can see right here the link. And click on sign up and go through the process of signing up and creating an account in SoundCloud. Uh, now, once you do that, you will get to a, a, a screen that will have your name here at the top. And you'll see an upload link. And so what you're going to do right here is click on Upload. And then you'll come to a window that says Choose a File to Upload or Start a New Recording. I would click on Start a New Recording. And then click on the red button. You'll get this little privacy thing about Adobe Flash. And you want to tell it to allow and remember and then press the button again. Now we start recording. So now I'm recording and one, two, three, four, five. That's my recording. I've done it, whatever it may be. Uh, then I click on upload your recording. This is titled audio recording on Tuesday afternoon. Okay. So it's public or private. You probably want to leave it as public right here. And then let's see, uh, transcoding right here. It says upload completed, transcoding completed. That's good. Depends how long that takes, depends how long your recording is. So now you are going to go down here and click on save. Right here, and here's your recording. You click on it, it plays it. But again, now we start recording. Okay. I'm going to click on share right here. And there's my link to the audio recording right here. So I'm going to select that and do Control C if I'm on Windows or Command C uh, if I'm on an Apple. And then I'm going to go back to my course and let's say this is the forum I'm, that was created for me to upload my uh, sound recording link to. So I'm going to click on Audio Recording, add a new discussion topic. I will probably put my name in there. Calvin. Pergamy, uh, recording X, whatever it's about. And then in the message area, I'm going to put the link to my SoundCloud recording, then click post to forum. And it says your post was successfully added. And you have 30 minutes to edit if you want to go back and you know delete it and re-record it. So when somebody comes to the uh, discussion group, they can see your recording right here and uh, copy it and paste it right here. Uh, actually, I think I would do one other little quick thing, and I'm sorry. Uh, if you click on this little link right here, highlight this, and copy it again, you still have it copied, and you'll want to go to the link here, copy the link in there. Forgot that one little step. That makes it an active link, okay? Sorry about that. So I'm going to click on Save Changes. The post was updated. Continue. Now the link should be live. I click on the link, or whoever the professor clicks on the link, and they see your recording and click yeah, to play. Yeah, it's as simple as that. Okie doke. Good luck with your sound recording. Okay, how to create a SoundCloud file, an audio recording, and a link to it on your Moodle class. So, first go to SoundCloud.com. You can see the link right up here in the top. And once you get to SoundCloud.com, you want to click on the sign up and go through the steps necessary to create an account, a free account on SoundCloud. Okay? Now, once you get there on SoundCloud, you'll have your name listed here, your username, and you'll see this upload link. So you're going to click on the upload right here, and then you're going to click on start a new recording because you can record directly into the web browser. And then you'll want to click on record. And you may get a pop-up that says allow uh, uh, this is a flash device. So you'll get a um, little pop-up that you check allow. That way you can go ahead and finish your recording. So you click on record. And now I'm recording. Blah, blah. One, two, three, four, five, six. When I'm done, I click on the square. Then I click on upload your recording. And then it takes a couple of minutes, depending on how long your depending on how long your recording is, 
uh, it'll take a little bit to transcode. You could change the name. It says audio recording on Tuesday after Wednesday afternoon. You can name it and be more descriptive about what the professor would like you to do. And then leave it at public right here. And then down at the bottom, click on save. Now your recording is up and people can click on this little play button and listen to it. You'll click on share and here's the link right here. I click in there, it highlights the link. I copy it. Okay, I'm going to go back to your course here. I'm going to get back to the main part of the course. I'm going to click on the forum that your professor wants you to upload to here. I'm going to click on add a new discussion topic. I'm just going to say my name, Calvin Recording X, and the message is the link. Now you may you want to make the link active, so highlight the link, click here, paste the link in there as well, insert. Now that you see that it's underlined and active, if you don't see this link icon, it may be because this needs this little icon here on the left to the word left of the word paragraph needs to be clicked on. Okay? And then click on post to forum. Your post was successfully added. You have 30 minutes left to edit it if you want to make changes. So then click on continue. And there's your recording. I click there. I click on the link and it takes me to the SoundCloud. Click on record. It's as simple as that. Recording.